The Aprilia Pegaso is an enduro type motorcycle produced by Aprilia for European and neighbor countries. It was one of the first alternatives to the classic, total, desert road enduro motorcycles, presenting cycling characteristics more suited to use on asphalt and thus anticipating the evolution of road enduro motorcycles. It was presented to the public for the first time in 1989 in the 125 cc displacement. It was also produced in the 50 cc, 600 cc and 650 cc displacements. It finally went out of production in 2011. The first Pegaso presented to the public was the Aprilia Pegaso 125. It was introduced in 1989. The spec sheet figures and other aesthetic is definitely demands for a separate video. But you all think please comment down. The 600cc model in 1990 and later on, the maker released the 50cc version promising high in mileage, and the 650cc model in same year 1992. The Pegasus 600 was first presented in 1990 and with a displacement of 600cc as early mentioned, this model was characterized by a high volume single cylinder engine, the Rotax 560, precisely 562cc, already used on the Tuareg 600, from which it also takes the double cradle frame in square steel tube. The Pegasus 650 model was first. Presented in year 1992, the first road enduro to be equipped with a double spar aluminum frame. Renovated in terms of aesthetics and engine, it abandons the old Rotax 560 and switches to the 652cc Rotax 655 with 5 valves, 3 intake, 2 exhaust, controlled by 2 overhead camshafts controlled by a chain, no longer a toothed belt like on the old 604 of the Tuareg 600. The new engine is liquid-cooled and is more full-bodied, but the horsepower does not undergo a large variation despite the increase in displacement in the conceptually more modern engine, on the other hand it gains elasticity and driving torque. These first versions are called GA, and produced until the end of 1995, following the update done in collaboration with BMW, the MX series has been produced since 1996 where the engine is revised, in fact it no longer runs on bearings but on bushings, and the alternator is increased from 190W to 240W. In 1997, while the smaller displacement models were removed from the price list, the Pegaso 650 cube was presented with a new line, vaguely reminiscent of the RS, different chassis calibration, which varied the dimensions of the bike while also making various other changes in all the mechanical departments. In 2001, two other important changes were made, the adoption of electronic injection and the replacement of the upside-down front fork with a classic configuration. In year 2005, in its fourth edition, presented at the Intermote in Munich in year 2004, the Pegaso was completely renewed and offered in three different versions. Pegaso 650 Strada is for lovers of speed and tight curves, characterized by wheels with a diameter of 17 inches with alloy rims. The Pegaso 650 trailer is more comfortable and focused for traveling long distances, with a more enduro style, with 19-inch spoke front wheel, whereas the Pegaso 650 factory is similar in layout to the Pegaso 650 Strada with 17-inch wheels, features lighter components, gold spoke wheels and a sportier look, but without increases in power or torque compared to the touring version engine. All three of these versions have a new 650cc Yamaha, Minarelli engine credited with 48 HP, 35 kW, and a torque of 6 kgm. This single cylinder, although also used by many of the competing motorcycle manufacturers, has been revised by Aprilia with regards to the intake, injection and exhaust manifolds. In November 2006 the entire range was approved according to the Euro 3 regulation.